When I started making music, I went to a meeting with some big label, and it was a bunch of white men in a room. And they didn't understand that I was bilingual, that I was as American in, in my speech and in my songs as if I was Dominican and Brazilian. It just broke their brains. They were like, it's not possible. You have to do either Spanish or English. There was no cross-pollination between the two. That multiculturalism is being um, exposed now with all different artists bringing their culture into the American mainstream. We don't have to just change to accommodate their spaces right. anymore. Right, like code switching. Yes, so much code switching. You can be into rock and roll, you can be into metal, yes. and that's part of who we are as much as our culture is. Yeah. <laughs> I love my grandmother. She's one of my favorite people in the entire universe. But when I was a little girl, I was a tomboy. And she used to make me go to the seamstress and get these like bizcocho dresses done, these very poofy, <laughs> the things that I love to wear now. And I really hated that. And the word malcriada kept coming up, like, ¿Tú malcriada, muchacha? And you know, that's like, you don't respect your parents. You have no respect for the world. <gasps> and so I felt like malcriada could be the opposite, which is like- yeah, Take it back. Taking it back. I'm just super excited to embody this powerful malcriada persona. Yes. And just like, take a page out of the book of Jorina yes. and be like, we're very strong today. <laughs> and we're gonna give you some hips too. Bye-bye to the prim and the proper. Bye-bye to the pink and the posture. I, 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 I don't want to smile and wave. Bye-bye to the Ken and the Bobby. Bye-bye to everything you taught me. I, I, I think I'd rather misbehave. You know that I'm malcriada. And 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 you know that I'm malcriada. Sleep.